we all know why we're here today. I'm here to deceive you, beg you for your vote. And you're here to listen, aren't you? For what are us politicians but beggars and robbers? Hmm? We aren't elected by the people, we are elected by our own lives. And we admit this for every second we hold power. I promise to bring each of you your greatest wishes, every single one. I'm your father, your brother, and your friend. I would never hurt you, surely. You love me. But of course I'll abuse my power. I'll put my friends and family in positions far above you all. I'll tax you and I'll regulate you, but that's just the way it is. You're okay with that, aren't you? To me, you're just a number. I'll take bribes. Some of my people will commit horrendous actions, of course. You know how it is. Rules for thee, but not for me. Just accept it. Submit. You aren't people, not to us. We've never lived like you. We can't understand you or empathise with you. Of course not. Don't be silly. All we want from you is your vote. We want you to slave away. We want to take your money, your children, your ideals. You'll listen. You'll conform. You'll wear the shackles we give you so long as they look pretty and we throw you a bone every so often. You can pretend like some of us are different, different parties, different sides of the political compass, but for the most part, the end result remains the same. You will be suppressed. We will push you deeper. This is society. The role you play while we prosper. This is all you will live and die for from where I'm standing. Don't you feel depressed? Don't you want change to revolt? Don't you want freedom? But of course not. We as people are slaves. Why would we want it to be any different? We have our creature comforts. We get to consume our media all day, every day, as if it isn't pure brainwashing. It's just society. It's the way it's supposed to be. We don't need freedom of choice, so long as we can shut off our brains, work until we die, and leave no trace of who we were after the fact. We the people, we the people just want an easy life, to let someone else do the thinking for us. Those supposedly above us are free, free to do anything and everything they want. Some commit heinous acts, swept under the rug. Others are accomplices who hear and see everything, yet turn a blind eye to preserve their place in the hierarchy. We the people allow this. We aren't involved. All we did was give them the power, right? It doesn't matter if they obey none of the laws that apply to us. It doesn't matter whose lives they ruin, so long as it's kept far from us. We'll be good. We won't dissent. We are taxed for the privilege of existing with little reward while they spend our millions on their little pet projects none of us consent to all while enacting further laws and rules upon us. Does the taxpayer not have a say? Is the government not there to serve its people? A democracy, a republic, hilarious. We live under the thumb. We are oppressed and reviled. They have no connection to us. They are another breed entirely. We are many and they are weak and coddled few. We need to take back what is ours, our freedoms, our lives, 
our home. We are ruled by a class that may as well not be human. They have never lived like us. They can't understand us or empathise with us. Of course not. We are nothing to them. But that begs the question. Why don't we revolt? Why don't we make it all right as one people? We can't. There is no right or wrong, no matter who rules. The world is full of hate and evil. Why don't we revolt? Why don't we make it all right as one people? We can't. We are divided, told that we have nothing in common, told to hate each other for our differing views, backgrounds, colour, and of course, we do. Why don't we revolt? Why don't we make it all right as one people? We can't. We won't. We are lazy and complacent. We don't want to risk our lives as we know them. This is the way it's supposed to be. We don't want freedom. Isn't it sad? You can't do anything, won't do anything. But it's okay, we'll do it all for you. It'll be easier, don't worry. <clears throat> Thank you all so much for your time. I hope to see you all at the polls. Until then.